so what you need is just some crystals like these. I got a pack of these at Joanne Fabrics for uh, $13, but you can also use crystals like these ones. These are a little bit more expensive, but are shinier, so it's totally up to you on what look you are going for. Um, you can use this crystal application tool, but I felt like the crystals didn't stick as well with that, so I ended up using Gorilla Super Glue. So I just got this from the supermarket. You'll also be needing something to put the diamonds on. I use these as their nail tools, and I used the bottom of a spoon because I felt like putting the glue on like that was easier. So yeah, let's get started. So starting off, I just have my shoe and I wiped off the area of where I'm going to put the crystals with some rubbing alcohol. This is makes the surface clean. Then what I'm doing is I'm putting a little bit of the Gorilla Glue on the bottom of the little stick that I'm using. This is just going to make it tacky so it's going to make it easier to be able to pick up the diamonds or the crystals. Um, so I'm just going to go ahead and do that and then pick up the crystals and place them onto the shoe. You want to apply your glue first to wherever you you're um, putting the crystals like this. I'm taking a little bit of glue with the bottom of the spoon and applying it to where I want the crystals. You can also use E36000 glue. Is that how you say it? But yeah, both of like whatever glue you have that you think would be good, but this is the glue that I'm using. So I'm going to start off by just kind of outlining the Nike swoosh, but right now I'm putting one in the middle, but I thought it was easier to outline it. I'm using small crystals. Um, I've seen other people um, use like medium sized crystals with small crystals, but I just use small crystals for the entire swoosh. I thought about doing another shoe and using bigger crystals mixed in with smaller crystals so I might do that and then post a picture on Instagram so be sure to follow me on Instagram if you want to see what that looks like but it's pretty self-explanatory you just go around and you place your diamonds in the I'm kind of just working towards the middle of the swoosh now. Um, getting to this point it only took me actually like only like 10 minutes, so it's not that long. Um, I'm going, you can see me outlining it again, just I kind of outline it and then fill it in with the crystals. I found like this method was a lot easier because on the first swoosh I kind of just did it randomly and in the middle and just not all like outline and then like that but I feel like outlining it like that was way easier and then just filling it in with the crystals and they kind of just fit right into place as you guys can see. result I absolutely love it I was so in love with it so excited I love the way they turned out it was super easy and oh my gosh now they're like a freaking like cute swoosh that's diamond so crystal but I'm just gonna go ahead and put these bad boys on you can wear them working out while you're working out for a fun change or you can just wear them every day because you know what now they're dressed up and they're sparkly and they're cool so yeah that's what they look like absolutely love it oh my gosh you guys can see that's my happy dance yeah super cute I just enjoy making them like thoroughly and now I enjoy wearing them even more so yeah I really hope you guys enjoyed this video if you found it helpful be sure to give it a big old thumbs up thank you so much for watching and for all of your support be sure to subscribe if you have not already and I love you guys millions huge hugs bye guys